the tilt meter is just growing and growing and growing but when is it popping off last episode we had some fantastic moments in the tournament arc just destroying these stupid ass kids bro they rigged the tournament for us right against us actually making these special dumbass rules just to put us at a disadvantage but we still came out on top and at the end of the day rembrandt's sister won she's kind of fucking cracked now we still have like the not a battle royale. is it a battle royale i think it's like a team versus team thing but there's like a level cap thing therefore we have like less amount of students participating but at the end of the day i think a couple level 99 people are going to do better than a bunch of shitty level 30s or whatever they are now on the other side of makoto and what he's doing with the guild with, with the merchants guild right dude that was some infuriating shit we had to listen to this fucking dude just shit talk us the entire time and what he's saying is not objectively wrong right what he's saying is it's incredibly suspicious that your production is fucking insane your business scaling is insane but yet we don't see how you're actually you know maintaining this logistics nothing makes sense so it's actually very uh normal for someone to confront but he was being such a fucking dick about it he's being such an asshole about it right i'm not saying what he said was wrong but the way that he said it completely fucking off base and we're now even considering fuck the humans let's go to the demon continent and they're well, not the demon continent but where the demons are and the land around there is the land that our parents used to be so it just feels right it's almost like we're returning home that we were never at Plus the blue haired girl with the glasses, right? There's something about helping her out and, you know, freeing her. I forget, recapture her territory or something like that. I hope today is the episode that Makoto pops up. But based on the way that season two has been going, every episode has just been set up. In fact, this season kind of feels like a setup season. But hey, let's see what's going to happen in today's episode. Karano. Oh, so they were childhood friends. I'm going to assume this is the girl that he was kind of like harassing at the beginning of this arc when Makoto was there and kind of like trounced him, right? Is this the girl with the glasses or no? Is it the sister? I'm gonna assume it's the younger sister and not the older sister that works in the library, right? This has to be the younger sister that he was kind of like trying to like get with in the beginning, right? It's But they're both bar girls, aren't they? She, she kind of works there too, doesn't she? Aren't they like both the bar girls? She, she worked there once. The one without the glasses, right? The younger one. I think. Second son. What the fuck happened to you, kid? What happened? I like look at the things that he's saying. I lament the corruption of her nobility and seek reform, but he became the corruption that he seek to reform. What the fuck happened to you? Such a hypocrite. Damn, bro. He fell off so fucking hard. No amount of sad backstory will make me empathize with this kid. Disgusting. What is that? Oh, some kind of item? A certain student's secret. Probably the blonde kid. Look, what he said was kind of true. It's just the way he said it. You fuck the city. Just leave. Don't even tell him. I went for a pack of smokes. Oh, Rona. This is what's waiting for us, bro. Let's go to the demon continent. I you gonna say attack the city? <laughs> I would want them to attack the city. Nah, that's kind of mean. Which means there will be trouble. Choo! <laughs> I don't think she'd actually fucking do it, but the moment she put up the lick labs, what's she gonna do? Give me gonna fucking chew or something, bro? <laughs> that plan. That plan. As long as he's gonna help me take back my nation or whatever city, I'm gonna sleep. Is that what he's implying right here? Why are you naked right here? He would never ask her that. What do you fucking do? Get your clothes back on. He's not like that. Cap. Cap. Well, they did try very hard. Mm, the reason. What, what, do you, what did you bring her here for? Oh, 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 oh she's gonna take her clothes off. Spread your legs. A class from the elite reference. This 
motherfucker did that thing again. It's about that plan. And they even fucking blocked off the fucking speech bubble here, bro. That's so troll. No turning back, huh? Yeah, how Mitra lost the match was kind of impressive. That's kind of insane. But for her to like acknowledge Mitra like that is insane. 1500. That's actually such an honor though, to get personal training from Tomoe. I thought she would let him die, but like, you know. This is for a spot in the final. Oh, got it. Everyone's got their own ploys. <laughs> Everyone's so serious. I got a plan. No, I got a plan. I got a strategy. And what does she say? I will participate in the final with Shiki San in the audience. She is so fucking down bad for that skeleton, dude. Okay, what's going on, Battle Pass Armor? He also had some kind of bracelet thing, right? There seems to be some kind of bracelet, some kind of belt with a gem, right? Did he put it on yet? We'll see. <laughs> Adultered human. Hmm? And the amulet is the thing. Yeah, that thing, that thing. From his locker. But in reality, what does it do? Like what? His humanity? What's it absorbing? His life force? Maybe he got super strong with these all these OP amulets, though. Also, Makoto apparently taught them rock, paper, scissors. So, like, rock, paper, scissors is obviously a game from Earth. They didn't even know rock, paper, scissors here, huh? Kind of fun fact. What a fucking lunatic. Four papers in a row? Dude. Nah, you, you t the, the craziest thing is you tell your opponent what move you're gonna make, and then you go into their mind games, and then you fucking do that, right? It's like the levels. You tell them, I'm gonna go paper. And they're like, what? Well, shit. I'm gonna go scissors then to win. But wait! Did they lie to make me think that I'm gonna go scissors? Well, therefore, if I go scissors, maybe they'll do rock. Then I need to put paper out! But wait! You know, it's just like the fucking mental game. <laughs> Like he's gonna self destruct. Yeah, because the ref is all paid off. Love how he always narrates this shit because basically retelling of his events, right? What does Makoto see? Well, this soundtrack's hitting. Hibiki! This soundtrack is actually one of the best soundtracks I've heard from this anime. That's probably not gonna happen unless there's redemption for him? This makes him seem such a good person. Wait, are they, are they kidding me with the sad ass fucking sound? This soundtrack is one of the best soundtracks I've ever fucking heard. But the way that they're portraying him right now with Hibiki makes him look like a fucking fallen hero. What's going on? Fuck! This is the power of good music, man. Stop monologuing! No! I will not feel for you! Long time ago. Kirunen was the place that our parents are from, right? And that's the place that we were exiled. Uh, they were exiled or something. Betrayal? I forget. Yeah, yeah. And there's like negative stigma along with the... Uh, 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 <laughs> yeah, they ran away. Yikes. He, he seems like a really good person right now. This is fucked. Okay. 
多分は族である君がどうしてこの町にまだ幼かったのではっきりとは思う As in parents are dead, let the kids leave. So, I'm sorry. 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 What a fucking idiot, bro. Holy shit, dude. This is like, I don't think it's correct to call this a simp. I think this is insult behavior because if he was a simp, he'd be willing to look over it and, like, you know, be all nice to her. But he's like, I can't believe you forgot about her fucking promise. L, L, fuck you. Bro! Are you so desperate to live as a what? Yeah, yeah, we gotta kill all the people. Yeah, we gotta blow the city up. Yeah, Makoto, take all the good humans out of here. We gotta fucking, we gotta nuke this fucking town. You're an embarrassment to nobility. You know what's so ironic about this? How he said, I can't believe you forgot about promise. Well, I can't believe you forgot about what you said. How should nobility act? Is this the way that nobility should act? He's contradicting everything he said when he made that promise as a kid that he's so upset about the girl, but bro doesn't even remember what the fuck he said. L. Dude, she's probably been through hell. Four v one, four royals versus one lowly tavern girl. You're bad. You're getting up on her. You calling her a coward? Oh my god, she's spinning so much facts. Dude, she's got the eyes of a killer, man. Look at that. She's seen death. And then is this where he grabs her and this is when Makoto and Shiki shows up in the beginning of this arc? It is! Oh! So that's how it started! This is so funny. They're like, mm, who are these fucking noobs? Alright, behold, the power of nobility. And you know what they did? <laughs> they, they, they like... Mm, I, I can levitate! I, I I I can levitate now, <laughs> like two centimeters off the ground. It's like um, uh, that's that's cool, I guess. All right, how about we shoot you in the fucking sky up with this ground? Nah, you're getting in your own way. Then this is when she came up. Yes. And I think this has already been resolved, right? Yeah. Whatever. No amount of these pills could possibly match you to Kuzunoa level. No shot. I mean, yeah, there clearly are. I don't even feel bad for this guy, dude. This backstory. Oh, here it is. Ah, oh, here it is. The amulet gives you increases magic resistance, but Tomo or Mio said that. Actually, what it really does is, and that was kind of left for imagination, I'm going to just assume it eats away at your lifespan. It, like, takes something from you for more power. <laughs> so, <sighs> we know that it was Rona doing this entire time. Is she at fault? Because Rona was technically doing this to do a little more. Uh, uh, she, wait, am I understanding it wrong? Am I understanding it wrong? Or didn't she have um, different plans to figure out the whole experimentations here? Right? It's it's not like she just meant to spread the production of this drug around for fun, but it was all to kind of like research and figure out what the human experimentations were happening. Right? I think. That what's what's going on, or was Rona just like explicitly just <laughs> giving these random kids just drugs? Like here, just to, just take some fucking steroids. It was, was she was she just fucking around? <laughs> she did stop the experimentation, but along the way she saw some dumbass humans. She's like, here, take take, take something. I want I want to see if you could take some, bro. 
俺は何も気づいていなかった。子供。How did you not know, bro? You were like dying. Whoa. What is this? Looks like some kind of demon's awakening. Nah, it's not enough to take Jin out. Her name is Satania? No, no, no. Was that a spell? She's 1v5! I know there's six, but still. Damn! Yo, she's popping the fuck off. <laughs> Not his battle pass armor. No, bro. How the fuck is his steel armor getting cut by this goddamn wooden sword? Cause it's probably imbued by mana. But it's just so hilarious how Jin keeps using a wooden sword while this motherfucker is just decked out in Paduan armor. <laughs> Senpai. <laughs> He's like humiliating you. Don't give up now. Ah, we can't get the debt. Bro, you're bro. Where are you aiming? No, it's not. It's not him. It's not anyone else. It's yourself that you have to fucking look into. I am very interested how the dolls aren't damaged though. Because if you take damage like last time, the dolls take the damage for you. Maybe that has to do with the amulet. Imagine what Hibiki would say to this motherfucker right now if she was here. She would be even more disappointed. Yeah. Why are you yelling Kuzno at me, bro? Jin is too damn cool. He could straight up be the main character. What the What? What? The fuck? But the dolls. What about the dolls, though? Is there a reason why this move seems Japanese? Is there some kind of other reference here? They were not trained by Tomoe, were they? Did Tomoe teach them this shit? Because it's some samurai shit? I don't think so. Damn! Headshot! <laughs> she got it, don't worry. Nobody catches the other guy though. The three dolls are still up though, what the fuck? Zwaisa. Okay, I thought it was like the amulet that was like holding off some kind of damage stuff, but the dolls, you know, got destroyed, so yeah. Yeah, and Zwai is the blue lizard, right? Yeah, not Liddy, it's, it's just Zwai. Yo, I just realized something. The first two rows are regular animated, you know, NPCs, but the third row back just all turned to CGI. You sneaky motherfuckers. Yeah, the spear girl. Oh. Oh. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Amulet. Alien mana. From the other humans too? What is the demon? Yeah. But yeah, but like, you know, Rona still, she, she hates the humans. I, I'm kind of conflicted, right? Cause it's like, yes, yeah, she was here doing research on the human experimentation, but she was also kind of just giving away, you know, these steroids to these dumbass fucking humans. Cause you know, it, they're, they're fucking dumb humans and she probably just wants to see their downfall. So I understand that part, but it's like, but, but fuck the humans, but they're good humans, but there's good demons. But then what she's doing is kind of, I don't know. It's, it's, it's. Just all over the place, and yeah, Shiki did say it right. Shiki was like, That girl, she's a schemer. 
She just didn't tell you specifically. Exactly. We gave her too much credit, right? But she didn't lie, and she's so hot that I'm willing to just <laughs> look beyond this. I'm totally willing to look beyond this and side with her, even though she gave these dumbass human kids drugs and the amulet to do the shit. <laughs> Wait, was I wrong to think I could associate with demons? Ah, uh, shit. Last episode, I thought that we were going to cross the bridge and never come back and say fuck to humans. But now, second thoughts because of Rona. Hmm. I, I don't know. I don't know. No one's easy to get along with. <laughs> Mio might kill Rona. <laughs> Oh, tilt meter! Wait! The bar is at max, bro. The bar is at 120%, actually. Wait, 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 wait. I didn't understand that. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Kuzuno, wait, wait, wait. I was too busy getting, you know, hyped up over Makoto popping off. And then, so far, so good. Oh, this is what Ron is saying. I didn't expect the King of Limia and Princess Lily in this. Gotcha. If you're interested in demons, then I recommend you let this one go. I'm not sure what she's saying about this one. Is she referring to her self? As in, you know, I was spraying the drugs, but come on, forget about it. Is she referring to, you know, Irum, whatever, the blonde guy who's mutating, who might turn into a demon? I'm not really sure. Or is there a separate demon that's about to show up? I'm not really sure. That's kind of ambiguous what that is. I'm gonna just assume it's she's talking to herself, just talking about Rona and what she's done, yeah? <laughs> Apol- No, fuck him. No. Nope. Oh, you just- You just had to play that fucking best soundtrack I've ever had in this fucking anime. Give me that fucking backstory. But then that got ruined because he was apparently just fucking mad that she didn't remember the promise. But now he's like, oh, I just want to pop. No, it's just too many second chances. This is like the fourth chance. Ah. Fuck him still. Fuck him. Whoa, so many people. Is this happening to everyone in the village right now? I'm not sure if this is a different point in time. But like, this is all the effects that's kind of happening. Right? Right now? Wait? Wait? She gave every one of these people the amulets and then? What's going on? Demon invasion? Another episode of the tournament arc and things are going pretty damn well in terms of our progress, but that doesn't matter because we pretty much won. And now we're dealing with whatever Rona has been planting. Apparently, Rona has not been just going around giving drugs to this blonde kid, but she, I think, seemingly gave it to a lot of different other people, the amulet. And these are all the other people that's facing whatever the same thing that he's doing. I think that's what the interpretation of this is. But, okay, this is a turning point. Rona set some shit up, and she's saying, Kuzunoa, if you really want to do something, you'll let this demon go. I'm not sure if she's talking about her own actions or about what's about to happen here, but it's looking like next episode's gonna be fucking lit, and maybe, finally, Makoto will pop off after this goddamn tilt meter has been building up for fucking 16 or 15 episodes. But that's it for me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video and check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.